Hey everybody, David Lund with Excalibur Rings. Today's ring making video, we're gonna be making the Storm Ring. Uh, this ring contains amethyst crystals, a tungsten band, and then white glow powder. But I've always just been inspired and infatuated by just powerful storms with violet and purple backgrounds. Uh, so with the amethyst crystals, I really like the purple haze that comes with these stones. It's always been like one of my favorites to make. And I, if you look at my history of my ring making on Instagram, you'll see that I've worked with uh, amethyst and uh, other minerals early on in my career. So in today's ring, we'll, we'll be crushing the amethyst crystals so they're just nice and fine and then we'll be inlaying them along the uh, tungsten band and then we'll be saturating everything. We're just like finishing it up with just a nice white glow powder to kind of symbolize what, what I like to see in like a storm. This has been a really cool ring to make. So I'm excited to take you guys through the process and, and tell you about how I make our rings, so let's go ahead and get started. Justin here, senior ring maker at Excalibur Rings, and I'll show you how I go through the process of making the Storm Ring. As you can see, first things first, I'm using our UV light to test out which of our glow powders is the right glow, because we have a couple. And now I'm taking the adhesive and putting it on the tungsten band so that any powder or inlay that I pour is gonna automatically stick and make it easy to build up from there. Speaking of sticking, now we're pouring and sticking this white glow powder onto the ring. Pressing it down, making sure it's at equal level, so we have a beautiful polished ring when we're done. And here we are crushing up the amethyst into perfect pieces. They're gonna fit the ring and shine through with that lovely violet color. We're pouring it right into that ring and making sure that it shines. I like this white glow powder a lot because what it is is not only a pretty bright and vibrant white, but when you put your UV on it and let it glow, it really shows this fresh, almost powder snow-like look. It's very pretty. I'll be honest, this was probably one of the hardest rings to make when I started making it, just because you have to get really nicely sourced amethyst that's a vibrant enough color that it shines through and doesn't look milky and see-through. And for that reason it was hard for me to do because it would always look like there was holes in the ring. But eventually I was able to pick out the most colorful and popping purples in all of the amethysts that we use. And now I can honestly say it's one of the prettier rings that we make. That purple on white is a really nice color very smooth compared to some of the other more neon and vibrant colored rings that we make. Moving on to the sanding process, I use a low grit sandpaper and sand it down all the way to make it the perfect equal height with the band. Spray it down and it's ready to showcase. This here is the Storm Ring, a white glow ring with amethyst that shines through and mimics the storm in the night sky. If you like this video and our rings, make sure to subscribe to the channel, follow us on our socials, and check out our Excalibur Rings website where you can purchase all these rings and more.